It's a bitch. Get out of my house. Biddly Bart's 2024. Wee. I don't know how you pick a specific voice for characters. Whenever I'm thinking about my own characters talking, I imagine a very general voice for each of them in the ballpark, and I think they'd be it. But whenever I try to think about specifics, everything sounds off. I say I like tragedies, and everyone's all like, why do you like sad stories? Are you depressed? And never, how's the catharsis? Was the catharsis fun? Blanket normally. Really good. Blanket ten minutes before you need to get up for work. Skin contact with God. Love to cause situations. Hate to be near them, really. Undiagnosable. <clears throat> Butterflies when they flap their wings. Oh no. I have Ashton Kutcher butterfly effectism. Your Honor, I so humbly request that you allow me to be cringe about this one thing, and then I will never, ever be cringe again for real this time, I, t I promise. Lying through my fucking teeth. Man eating breakfast mortified, he was caught putting ketchup on his eggs by a cartoon chicken standing over his shoulder asking, You would surely take yolk? with a raised eyebrow and tensing muscles. So I'm putting ketchup on eggs. I find it pretty delicious. What do you do? Why are you guys breaking into my house? Stop it. I love ending emails with, thank you in advance. Like, what are you going to do now? Not do the thing I already thanked you for? Bring dishonor on yourself like that? Oh no, I don't think so. Checkmate, you have been played by the master of manipulation. And thank you in advance. Nobody understands the bond between a girl and the mediocre book she read when she was 13 years old. This is very, very important, by the way. Do not reread the book. It might still be on your shelf. It's tempting you. Do not give in. It's the devil talking, and you will be let down. Exceptions apply. Is it pronounced gif, jif, or gif? This might be shock, but it is pronounced jif. Go forth, my incorruptible elven warriors, into the lair of the nefarious succubus. My lord, the peasants have reported strange sounds from the succubus's lair. Sounds of... giggling? Oh, impossible! But even so, my chaste warriors have yet to return. Son of cadre of the holiest elven nuns, post haste! Oh no. Friedrich Nietzsche has released a new ebook. I... I simply don't think that's true, ebooks.com, but thank you anyway. <laughs> God may be dead, but I'm not. Freddy Neats in his new book, Dare Skill Issues. <laughs> Adulthood is making your mom cookies to take to work and jokingly tell her, you may have one after, after dinner. dinner. More importantly, you're getting paid to make your cookies. That's kind of evil market that you have. A train is like a girl. If you're not careful, she could bite your head clean off. You say that like it's a bad thing. It isn't a bad thing. Just a warning. The idea that only women can give birth is a misconception. Men can give birth too, and that's a Mr. Conception. <laughs> Mr. Conception. Did you know? Touch your monitor. It is warm. Like flesh. But it is not flesh. Not no, yet. No, 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 no. The captain was just a plot device. A very crunchy one, reminiscing on poor Captain Barnabas, who was eaten by a hydra. I understand some of you are 19, but that is not an old man. He's 32. I take this personally. Me completely by myself in my room. All right, everybody, just calm down. Freaking love Discord, because you'll say something like, My sister had her baby this morning, and the reactions on it will be this. God, they would have thrived in ancient Egyptian times. I'm not actually mad. I just like the comedic delivery of righteous but pointless anger. You fucking- There should be a special place in hell for those who renovate Victorian houses to have modern interior. Like, what the hell's wrong with you? I hope the ghosts kill you for real! Touching his extremely defined six-pack. <laughs> who did this to you? And culture is dissociating so hard you forget where you are. No, seriously, where am I? My boyfriend's back at it with the great pictures of barbs. You either die the early bird, or live long enough to become the worm. <laughs> this area is under constant video surveillance. Hmm. 
<laughs> Fuck, it sure is. Um, bro, why are you playing in the JP Voices? You voiced in the game before. Umahara is El Haytham, next question. What's so special about El Haytham's JP voice? Let me go check. Oh. Oh my, oh gee, oh heavens, oh mm, yes, oh wow! For those of you who need the experience, let me just, uh... <laughs> oh, I love it when people use shrimp to mean beyond the human range. Like, shrimp colors, but apply to other things. Shrimp emotions, shrimp sounds, shrimp morality. As if shrimp are living some kind of transcendent experience that humans can never comprehend. They might. And we'll never know. Because we can't comprehend it. Ugh, my brain is full of lore, but my writing hands are full of lead. This post is a big yeet. Weighted blanket isn't enough. I need to get put into a panini press and cooked until lightly toasted in golden brown. Waffle type behavior, to be honest. Being self-taught in any type of practice will eventually lead to you having to seek out formal learning resources to bridge what you think is a trivial knowledge gap and realizing that you've been operating similarly to that French guy who went about his daily life unknowingly missing 90% of his brain. It's a bit of an eye-opener, not gonna lie. Uh, hmm. Well, how am I supposed to leave the house now? You aren't. You have a depression nap for too long and wake up feeling like a giant salamander. You know, like this. Hey, how did you get this picture of me? What a year this week has been. It's Monday. It sure as hell is. No, the earlier in the day, Monday, you reblog, the funnier this gets. The funniest is if you reblog this on a Monday that is also January the 1st. I relate to vampires because I, too, must be clearly and specifically invited in before I have the audacity to try to participate in anything. I'm socially awkward, leave me be. Baby girl, I will invent stages of grief you have never even seen before. Like the stage of grief where you eat nothing but soup. I'm going to be real with you, Harlequins. A new year does not equate for a better time. Our collective actions do. So stick to betterment. Personal betterment so that we can have a better year. Thank you, Sullivan. Spamton. Genuinely thought this was a search bar. Just, just, just put me down already. The bisexual to Era Ace Pipeline is pretty much having the right idea and coming to the wrong conclusion. Yeah, buddy, you're not straight and you're also not gay. No, 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 not like that, though. The other way around. I feel the same way about everyone. Yeah, you do. Because you don't. Do you get it? Yeah, I got taken to an axe throwing tonight. I may not have impressed anyone with my technical axe throwing skills, but my sheer brute animal strength is unparalleled. I was there. The sheer force was astounding. How did you do it twice? Getting a 20 inch strength and two in dexterity. Am I right or am I right, Andy? Up top. <coughs> Improve your military base's connectivity with Verizon. <laughs> what do you think I am exactly? No thoughts. Only baby. Where? Oh my god! Well, what's her wisdom? Such beautiful words. If you see this post on the day you were born, happy birthday! Congrats! Today was, Today the, was the day you escaped. escaped. That's some stuck. Does it have any of those damn horses in it? Something tell me his deactivation was justified. I'm not a capitalist, but having a job and money is great because I no longer loathe everyone and everything in the world around me. <laughs> oh, I know a psyop when I see one. Andy, get his ass! I hate doing these posts, but if this gets 10,000 notes by February 12th, which won't happen, I will ask for therapy and please do not feel forced to add notes. <laughs> This is the blessing bat, and you don't have to do anything for it to work. Once you see it, you are blessed forever. Joy, blessing bat be upon ye. I love him. Look at his little face. Fumbler. Tumbler, except everyone's just making jokes that never land. They're good jokes, great ones even. They just fumbled to delivery. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> okay. If you change your gender on the exact frame someone misgenders you, 
you'll perform a perfect parry, and they will become transgender. Can you imagine pulling the no you card on that? Imagine if people still took last names from their trade, like Fisher, Smith, and Fletcher. Imagine some guy introducing himself to you as Jonathan Podcaster. It is I, Patrick Voice Actor Man. There's no difference between exercise and black magic. Both of them hurt your body at first and drain you of energy, but the more you dabble into it, the more powerful you become. That's the most inspiring thing I ever read. The worst animal? Ugh, disrespectful. It just kind of sucks. And what are you bringing to the table? I would like to see a little lizard. Here you go. He has a little helmet. <gasps> the perfect being does exist. Once in my science class, the teacher said to go to the C-section, and in a moment of sheer stupidity and muscle reflex, I said, that's how I was born. And now I have to live with the fact that I will never top that ever again. You know, shouldn't have put the new year in the middle of winter, because then everyone expects you to get your shit together in January. Uh, of, all, of, all, of all times. What's your New Year's resolution? Oh, uh, gee, I don't know, uh, fucking survive? Why don't you ask me again when I'm not vitamin D deficient? I think, oh, my childhood doesn't even impact me that much. And then I'm afraid to sit in the living room. The living room! The interaction I just had on TikTok is the best I've ever had. The Victoria and Albert Museum, look at that stolen shit. In a way, Britain is like a fantasy thieves guild became a nation. Yes. Yes, we fucking are. I'm taking three levels of rogue now, mandated by law. Come on. Give it up. It takes so long and it's so tiring. But if I don't make art for the rest of my life, I'll die. I also have a sneaking suspicion that if you continue to do art without taking breaks, that might kill you too. Because chances are you're probably passing that down to your great grandkids as inheritance. Do you think autistic people dislike eye contact because of ancestral memories from Medusa times? N no. N no, I don't. Well, I do. Being called ugly your whole life and then having people attracted to you is some weird ass feeling. I, I don't know what to do with it. I'm a fly in the sky. Yahoo! I'm gonna see your house from here. I'm gonna move into your house. You're gonna pay right now. I'm on the rent now. Put me in your pocket. Buy the gotcha games. Do it. Do God, it. I have no idea how to start these videos anymore. Um. Sorry to any bands who see me yawn during their show. It's not you. It's just past 10 p.m. I hope you understand. I was today years old when I learned about Xin Yu Chai. I hope I got that one right because I've actually been trying to study Chinese. A convenience store hanging on a cliff in Hunan that's been nicknamed the most inconvenient convenience store in China. God, I bet the food there is great. <laughs> I think it's a really funny Garden of Bam Bam characters don't have eyelids when they're passed out or asleep. It just, it just looks like this. God, so dissociating so hard right now. Wish I could filter every video on YouTube with the word iceberg in the title. Quietly and bashfully delete that essay on lettuces I've been working on. No. What have I done? It's been a creative lull this week. Sorry, guys. Yeah, I'm gonna need a ukulele apology for this one, Bucky. All right, starting this now. Day one of telling you to go to bed. Day 660 of telling you to go to bed and you still won't? The year is 2024. You walk into your local coffee shop. A latte costs $12. You have the choice of tipping 75%, 95%, or 125%. You sheepishly tap 75% and feel bad about yourself. The barista shakes his head in disgust. Get out, you worm! You know, the Will Poulter glow-up needs to be studied. Dude transformed into a Hemsworth brother. How to... How do you do that? To everyone with sensory issues. You are not a baby for melting down because of under-overstimulation. You are not being immature or just throwing a tantrum when you have meltdowns. 
the discomfort and pain and fear you feel due to your sensory issues is real and valid and shouldn't be dismissed as silly or unimportant by people who don't understand it. A girl of about six or seven was babbling nonsense words at her mom, and I thought to myself, she should be able to form real words and sentences by this age. But then the mom responded in kind, and I realized, oh, wait, they're, they're speaking they're French. French. Official anti-France post. The bravery of a girl who has to decide what is for dinner and then cook it and then wash dishes every day forever and ever. That's called being an adult. No, it's called being the bravest girl on planet Earth. What people who say, don't say 30 year olds are old, 30 is still young, don't understand is I know that. I'm not calling my 25 year old coworker old because I believe it. I'm calling him old because I enjoy psychological warfare. You're a monster. Andy, hit him with the hardest punishment of all. Take away the chocolate milk. I sentence you to thinking about dragons for 10 billion years. Yeah, I did this to that one band. Young adult titles must contain one of the following words or you have to pay a fine. Blood, Crow, Queen, Ice Crown, Fire, Bone, True, Academy, Magic, Glass, Shade, Kingdom, World, Shadow Song, Sun, Ember, Secret Legend, Star, Raven, Thief. Yeah, I think I read that book once. How I do world building. List of questions neatly answered in a Word document? Nah. Muddled but comprehensive notes in various notebooks? Mm-mm. Someone asked me questions that I have to pretend I already thought about the answer? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hey, how's the writing going? I'm glad you asked. My room has never been cleaner and I decided to take up baking. <laughs> oh, I can't believe you blocked me. Just because I read everything you said in bad faith with open hostility. The nerve. Hmm, I disagree with you, but I could not possibly wade through the cranberry bog of my mind to verbalize why. Hmm, it appears your stupid big paws prevented you from tapping a coherent argument. <laughs> Ham Seymour, if I do a little dance and recite the ancient chants to summon you, can you assure me that you won't trick me and steal my soul in exchange for being in one of your Tumblr videos? I also have coffee for you if you're interested. Hmm. Make him do a little dance, Andy. I want to see if they pass the vibe check. Hmm. The dance is good, but it doesn't quite tell me the entire character backstory in the dance. I'm sorry, it fails the vibe check. Andy, take this all. I'm just trying to start the video, but the freaking audio interface wasn't even on, so I gotta go back and do a bunch of these things. We Going over to my minimalist girlfriend's house, and she apologizes profusely for the mess, and there's just a single, perfect, fresh pee on the floor of her living room. And for those who are listening and not looking at the video, the, the, the vegetable pee, not, not, not the at- Why do I like girls with muscles? No, it's not so they can crush me. I'm not that primitive. No. I like them because they went through trial and challenge to get strength and figure. And they worked hard for it. Also, muscular women make my brain go <laughs> Former Yahoo CEO Marissa Mayer reveals she regrets buying Tumblr instead of Netflix or Hulu. Yahoo bought Tumblr in 2013 for $1.1 billion, but by the time it was sold in 2019, the value of the platform was reportedly down to $3 million. And why did the value plummet, Marissa? Why, why, why did it plummet? Boom! Hmm? All right, I give up. Which Greek hero is Polycules, and why do you guys keep talking about him? Uh-oh. This pronunciation of polycules is going to be stuck in my head for a while. Yesterday, I got the, are you a boy or are you a girl question from a six-year-old, and I told her that some people aren't boys or girls, like me. I was expecting her to be a little confused, but she nodded thoughtfully and said, wow, just like snails. Yeah. I wonder who God saw eating that he decided gluttony was a sin. Gluttony in the original historical context is about hoarding wealth and resources, not about someone eating too much dinner one night. Realizing the bad guy in Seven actually didn't do his research. Disappointing. This month I'm doing something called J January, where I try to make it through every day January. Failing. To challenge, you must put in efforts. A promise does not do the work for you. Guys, I think this is my new god. Going forward, I will consume only problematic media. 
And well, <laughs> that's just to say, uncritically too. Oh my god, so brave. Thinking, <laughs> what if I jokingly ship them? Is your last chance to get out, by the way? Honestly, no. If you think that, it's already too late. It's the fandom's equivalent of the game. You already lost, buddy. Take it from me. He's got that previously neglected shelter dog, Riz. He looks like he wants to quietly sit next to you on the couch while you watch TV. He looks like he lets out a pathetic, sad little sigh sometimes for no reason. Oh my god, I love him. The news is always like, America has banned wheelchair ramps because they weren't in the Bibble. Finland has made ice cream free. Why does Finland always get the nice things? For all the people that think they're bad at responding to emails, I emailed the professor 12 years ago asking about source recommendations for a paper I was writing for a class during my undergrad. He replied to my email, TODAY! TODAY! Behold, train car that was leaking corn. What a fantastic fucking day to be a squirrel. Or a deer. I bet the deer were thrilled. Can you imagine? What kind of fey human bullshit's going on now? You can eat from the corn river, but the metal dragon that hunts between the banks may get ya! One time I dreamt I was in the Disney store at the mall. A Kids Bop-esque cover version of Bodies was playing, sung by Adina Menzel as Elsa. You know, she would totally rock that though, let's be honest. Imagining a world where Ass Jeeves went out as the most popular search engine so people having arguments online saying stuff like, Literally just ask Jeeves about this, it's not hard! Fuck it, I want to go back. Oh, I need this. I need this in my life. Why did we get Google? I'm not going to buy your art if you're going to reblog creams. <laughs> <laughs> this is one of the funniest ass I've ever gotten. I, I don't even know how to respond. You're on the cringe website. Do you also get mad when you open a book and words are inside? <laughs> Do you also get mad when you open a book and words are inside go so hard it does not deserve to be a reply on Tumblr to an Anon hater? It should be in a museum. The narrative starts the third act by repeating a scene from the first act, but now it has a totally different context. Me. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be good. I will say. I am mildly disappointed that in the murder mystery setting of Fontaine in Genshin, we didn't get a Hercule Poirot character. Pam, can you elaborate? Ah, fresh face, I see. Hercule is one of the most iconic European detectives in murder mystery novel series. And since Fontaine is a melting pot of European countries with an entire murder mystery plot, you know, it would have been perfect to sneak in as a reference. For visual references, if you've seen these guys in movie trailers, that, that, that's the character that's here right there. Look at that mustache. What do you mean, PM? Hercule is right here. My God! Oh, speaking of cold openings, water drinkers, cold or room temperature? Yeah, no one who actually drinks water prefers cold. Like, it, it hurts your teeth. Why would you do that? Cool things about being an adult. Eat chips whenever you want. No bedtime. Tired all the time. Sad all the time. Wait a second. Transgender as in transported gender. I broke into your house, and now I'm hightailing it with my Volvo with your gender in the back. Toodles, sucker! I'm in the silent waiting room for therapy, trying to not laugh. <laughs> How dare you? Oh yeah, the children are talking about nihilism again. Okay, let me enlighten you, Claude Pauls. Life's value comes from those who live it. Living life gives it value. Thinking about the end does not teach you to love the journey. Knowing it will one day end makes it sweeter to love and hate and care. Feel it all. Think, eat, sleep, but don't give up. Never give up. Thank you, Salivan. You know, that 2K you worked hard for is better than 100K that's given to you for free. Don't ever give anyone advice again. In fact, Andy, j just give him the look of shame. How dare you? It's not a one-sided conversation. The animal is literally blinking at me and understanding. He knows me better than you. When a nurse checks your blood pressure, they should just immediately clarify whether it's good or bad. Hmm, 130 over 90. Okay, cool. Are we just saying numbers? Like, is it good? Is it bad? By the way, it's bad. Whenever I see beautiful women on the dashboard, I scroll as fast as I can because I know one time it's going to be this sneaky witch trying to get me. What about beautiful men? Well, I can stare at them all day, my friend. Bad news, everyone. 
Sneaky warlock. Warm baked goods are insane. Something so beautiful and almost maddening about absolutely tearing into them when they're fresh. Feeling warm all over after. I really do get vampires for real. You clearly don't own an air fryer. You know, slow day in the robot girl community, huh? In power saving mode. On standby. The Lego my mouse and push my keys, I'm aping, do not awaken! Speaking of which, Andy, put up your favorite robot girl. That, that's a good one. Good job. Hey, why is it called creepypasta and not... <sighs> Finicini, you Fredo! I... No! So good! Why is it not? Surely the cancers won't quince. She cons on my quince till I... Wrap her the cushions. Peer reviewed. God damn. The beauty of Tumblr's retro chronological dash is that when you come back online, if the first post you see is, okay, I'm normal now, you know, you're about to witness the most spectacular meltdown a mutual has ever had in recent memory, followed by the impetus that triggers the entire event. Love it. Baby girl, if having LGBTQIA plus characters in my creations is woke, then baby girl. I am an insomniac. Ow, my eyeballs. If I ever got married, I would use the reception as an opportunity to just play every song I've ever liked. No theme, no vibe, just me being like, oh my god, I love this one! For two hours. Guarantee you're gonna hear a lot of Final Fantasy music. Listen mean is just, <laughs> it's just so funny. <laughs> How do you even get your hair to be like that? Secret white moon cocoon form. It's to hide from the Wonder Bread guy. Don't you utter those words in this house! Y'all ever see a piece of fan content about your favorite character that is so horrifically different from what you personally believe and you just... <laughs> Why? Oh, sure, everyone loves witches until we start doing witch shit. Now I'm weird and you're scared. Why are you turning me into a new? I got better.